Okay, brand new song by Pow Food. This is Life in a Locker. Uh, kind of a cool idea. Definitely, I think this is probably a level two, but uh, some cool strumming patterns and yeah, about four chords. Let's check it out. Okay, so the first chord is gonna be this F major seven nine chord, uh, which is gonna be here, third fret on the fourth string. Uh, then you do ring finger and pinky finger on fifth fret on the third and second string. So it's, it's kind of this power chord shape, but if you can, you try to bar and get this extra note, third fret on the first string, right? So that's the first chord. And this is one of many ways to play it, I think. Uh, but this one's kind of nice because this has a rotating bass over kind of a core uh, chord, right? So the chord at the top doesn't really change, but the bass note does. So first one, F major seven, then we just move up our bass note from uh, third fret fourth string to third fret fifth string. And that makes this a C major without really having to move these two fingers. Pretty sweet. Okay, then um, we're just gonna add, so instead of third fret on the fifth string, now it's gonna be fifth fret on the fifth string. And then I slide my pinky forward, makes this a D minor seven, right? And then we move our bass note one more time, fifth fret on the top string, makes it an A minor seven chord. Okay, so let me review that one more time. So bar, F major seven nine chord, move the bass to C, C major chord. Keep your ring finger where it is, move the bass note and the pinky forward, D minor seven. And then slide the pinky back to five there. Change your bass note to A, so A minor seven. So uh, now we go on to the strumming pattern. Strumming pattern is pretty easy. You're gonna go down, 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 up. And when you do the up, you change to the next chord, okay? So watch that. So F, down, 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 up, right? And then up, down, down. So that's the full pattern. Down, 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 up, down, down. Then we change and we do the exact same pattern just with the next two chords. Down, 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 up, down, down. Okay, so a couple more times, really slow. simple part it's kind of I wouldn't call it the chorus it's like post chorus there's kind of this interlude part but uh, they go to that first chord the F major 7 thing but instead of changing halfway through they do the full pattern there so down 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 up, up down down and again down, down, up. and then you change to the you, you actually leave the top part of this chord and you just move to here which is gonna be D fifth fret on the fifth string and you do the same thing, so twice through on the strumming pattern. So the reason I'm doing this, um, it does sound like in the recording that the only thing doing that change is actually the bass guitar, but I'm assuming some of you aren't gonna have a full band, so you might as well do the part that, that the bass is doing just to kind of keep the spirit of the song. So um, hopefully that makes sense for you. Last thing we're gonna do is the uh, solo scale. Okay, so if you wanna jam over this uh, and just have some fun, uh, practice your soloing, then you're gonna start right here, A minor uh, blues. So that's gonna be five, eight on the top string, five, seven on the next string, five, seven on the next string, five, seven, five, eight, and five, eight, okay? And then just practice going up and down on that. Come up with your own patterns. Also, I've been doing that for every song for the last like year, I think. Um, let me know in the comments if anyone's actually doing that, because I'll save you time if you don't want to do the solo stuff. But I seriously think you should. It helps open up your ear, makes you a better musician, more responsive, connect to the songs that you like a little bit more. Um, but maybe just let me know in the comments if it did help you. I'd love to hear someone that's starting to play solos because of that. Cool. Okay, great song. Tag me down in the comments if you have any other recommendations for new artists or new releases uh, or requests. I'm, I'm always taking requests. Hit like and subscribe so I can keep building the channel and we'll see you soon.